everybody, it's Colette with Blessings Craft Therapy with another project. Friends, it's pencil week. Get used to it. It's fine. We're going to make pencils out of these clothespins. All right, so I got some clothes from clothespins from Dollar Tree, and I paint it all orange. The inside, the outside, the sides, paint it all orange. I did several because you know I love the number three, but you do as many as you want. Then I take a pencil and I mark um, the, like the pencil lead and um, where the each of the colors are going to go, right? Um, so I did one for the black, I did another line for the brown, and then I did a top line for the silver. Does that make sense? Okay. And I do it all the way across, like you want to make sure that you go on the sides as well, unless you don't want to do the pattern continuing on the sides. If you want to do just the top of the clothespin, then you don't have to do that part. But I wanted to, for some reason, I like to make things more difficult for myself. <laughs> so I did it all over the place. Fine. So there we go. Perfect. Then we're going to then fill it in. So we do, and I'm using chalk paint, nothing crazy pants. And I'm just using, oh, and I'm using a makeup brush. Yeah. And then I do the bottom part. I did black for the ink or the, the lead, <laughs> the ink. So there's that. And I let it dry. Then I do the next layer, which is a light brown. I suppose you could even do a tan. That would be fine. This is just what I had on hand. And I actually made a little bit of a zigzag wavy um, on the top by the orange part just because I like to make it look like it's just sharpened pencil but you do you could do a straight line that would work too it looks just as cute but again if I can make my if I can make things more difficult for myself I apparently will look for any opportunity to do that <laughs> it's fine anyways it's cute it's fine again this is chalk paint and I just went around and I continued the pattern but again if that's not your jam don't do it it's fine it's fine um, yeah, and then let it dry really well. Perfect. Then we're going to do, and I did the inside too, just so you know. Then I do a silver chalk paint at the top. You could even use a paint pen for this. Oh, friends, a paint pen would work. Oh my gosh. See, I just thought, <laughs> I just thought of this. I'm like, oh my God, a paint pen. Ding, ding, ding. Light bell. The light bulb is going off now. It wasn't when I was doing this, but that's fine. Paint pens would work. Posca pens, even markers, I bet would work great. That's okay. So I did so silver and then I did pink at the very tippity top. Super cute, right? Oh my gosh. And again, I did the inside, the sides, all of the things. I love it. I think it's super cute. Now you could stop there, but you know, I won't, right? So I took a Sharpie and I wrote number two because my husband told me that pencils say number two on the side. So of course I had to do that. Adorable. Even though I think I might have done number one, but whatever. And then I also added those little whimsical, you know, like those little whimsy things. Super cute. You could stop there. But yet again, I didn't. I made these little cards that say, looking sharp and you're right on point. Come on. That's hysterical, right? And then I just put a slice on the end. And then I added in my little paper clip. It's not a paper clip. It's, it's a clothespin bookmark. Come on, Colette. I know. Love me through it. But look at how cute these are. Are you kidding me? And yes, I have the digital download available in my Etsy shop. If you are a paying subscriber to my page, then you will get these as well in the subscriber section of the page. All right, friends. Thanks so much for watching. And I hope this inspires you.